Hello today's video we have the following content. Magnolia awards red carpet, Tang Yan's battle suit, the Yu Yifu becomes thinner. The Magnolia awards are a big award that has been awarded one after another. It has become more and more popular in recent years. It has become the most influential drama film award, and it has also made artists more interested in exploring it. This year's Magnolia Awards has always been the focus of attention since the nomination. This red carpet event was star-studded, and it was unprecedented. The grandness of the red carpet shows the importance of the major awards in the shortlist. At this year's Magnolia Awards ceremony, Tang Yan was definitely the most shining and confident one. She wore a compact-style evening gown to compete for the Oscar for Best Actress. Now, for female stars, well-designed fashion is no longer a rare thing. Less famous actresses can also participate in some occasions with high-end custom-made evening gowns. Of course, this is also divided into three, six, and nine levels. Luxury goods like Armani are not easy to rent. Tang Yan appeared on the red carpet in Armani's new high-end dress. So far, only two female artists in China have worn the latest season's couture gowns. One is Shuki, who has worked with Armani for several years, and the other is Tang Yan. Tang Yan was able to wear this couture gown because she saw the potential between her and Queen Mulan, which is a powerful combination. Tang Yan wore a navy blue mid-waist skirt, and the whole person looked like a dazzling new star. The dress she wore was completely in line with the character of Ms. Wang, the Pearl of Puxi she played. Tang Yan, who is in her 40s, is not yet 30, but her skin is still fair and tender, exuding a noble and elegant temperament. This time, she was so free and easy. Many years ago, one of her old friends, Tong Yaro, wore an Armani couture suit to attend the Magnolia Award ceremony and finally won the award. I wonder if Tang Yang can have such luck and whether her transformation this time will be a success or failure. Hu Jie and Tang Yang stepped onto the red carpet hand in hand. Hu Jie was nominated for Best Actress for Flowers. As a film emperor, he behaved calmly. The two have known each other for a long time, and they are still the same. The pair of lovers shone brightly on the red carpet and instantly became the focus of everyone's attention. Liu Yifui starred in her first work after the show The Legend of Rose was just finished. She has lost a lot of weight. She is wearing the latest floral dress in The Legend of Sword and Fairy, with long black hair and precious jewelry. She looks like a blooming rose, beautiful beyond words. This time, she came with her brother and sister-in-law. Tuang Duai is as gentle as ever, and he interprets the appearance of a good man vividly. Wang Xi, on the other hand, looks shrewd. She is wearing a black dress, with long curly hair, and exudes a strong feminine flavor. She looks very beautiful. In addition, Liu Yifui and Chen Zio appeared together again. This is the second time they have joined hands to serve as overseas spokespersons for Chinese TV series after their partnership in Young and Dangerous two years ago. This is also the first time Chen Zio has appeared in public since announcing his marriage to Michelle Chen. Chen Zio was wearing a black suit and walking on the street, which was very eye-catching. His bald head was even more eye-catching, and he exuded a compelling aura. He had his hair cut because he was going to make a movie, but he was really handsome and was not afraid of any style. He looked wilted, lost a lot of weight, and his body was a little deformed. It was obvious that he did not intend to respot the rumors about divorce, but focused on filming and work. Both he and Michelle Chen focused on their careers. Zhou Soon also wore a high-end custom dress from Xiangjia and appeared on the red carpet of the Magnolia Awards with the staff of Imperfect Victims. For Magnolia Awards, she flew from France to Shanghai. It seems that Tang Yan's biggest competitor has finally appeared. Zhou Soon is gentle and quiet, but she won the Magnolia Award. Another nominated actress, Yang Ni, also performed quite harmoniously in the photo with Zhou Soon. Yang Ni is getting more beautiful as she gets older and a grand white dress shows infinite charm. There are many beautiful actresses in The Incomplete Deceiver, Lin Yun, Zhang Chuxi, Ying Er and others are widely praised for their outstanding looks. Zhang Chuxi and Ni Huang Ji, two actresses with a wide age span, each has their own beauty, and the photos taken are even more eye-catching. The new generation of young students compliments Lin Yi's style, showing a unique personality and exuding youthful vigor. Surprisingly, Wang Yang also participated in the Magnolia Award. Compared with Shen Tun and Zun Ruli appearance in The Wind Chaser, this time, he wore a black suit, and the whole person looked particularly energetic, calm and mature, and very personal. Deep and excellent writing plan. However, due to competing with Fan Wei, Hu Jie and others on the same stage, his chances of winning the award are not great. 
In the end, it is really hard to predict who will be the best actor. This time, most of the leading actors have been nominated, and on the highly anticipated Oscar night, it is undoubtedly a very exciting thing to be able to stand at this highly anticipated award. Next news. Magnolia Awards, Tang Yan is as thin as a pole, Wan Jin is the focus. The red carpet of the 29th Shanghai International Film Festival Magnolia Award has begun. Actors from several crews such as Flowers and Story of Roses have come, and it can be said that all the stars have gathered together. In addition to Liu Yifri, who was born in 1985, there are actresses born in 1985 such as Tang Yan and Zhang Ziaofri, and Wan Jin, who has been hotly discussed recently because her husband was exposed to an extramarital affair. Under the shooting of high-definition cameras, the original appearance of these celebrities was clearly presented, which aroused heated discussions among netizens. On the same day, Tang Yan walked the red carpet with Hu Jie and Fan Xianshan. In Wong Kar Wai's Flowers, she was nominated for Best Female Actor for her role in 85 Flowers and won the title of Best Actress at the Shanghai Magnolia Film Festival. Tang Yan wore an Armani haute couture starry sky evening dress with a string of blue jewels on it, symbolizing the tranquility of the starry sky. However, Tang Yan's slender body aroused heated discussions among netizens. From a street photo posted online, she is tall and stands among the crowd, like a little bamboo pole, which is particularly eye-catching. The slightly pointed jaw gives people a slightly thin feeling. No matter how gorgeous the clothes are, they will give people a feeling of incongruity. Even the thick eyebrows can hardly cover the fine lines at the corners of her eyes. However, Tang Yan, who is in her 40s, can be seen from a distance that she has a good figure, especially her sweet smile, which adds a bit of charm. Compared with the thin Tang Dan, Liu Yifei looks more flexible. This time, she wore a S's spring and summer haute couture dress and Bulgari jewelry on her hands. Like a sweet and gentle peach princess, she co-starred with Tong Dui and Lin Yi in The Legend of Rose and walked the red carpet hand in hand. However, some people think that Liu Yifei always appears in a princess dress, which makes people feel a little aesthetic fatigue. In fact, there are some problems with the style of Liu Yifei's skirt. The slit of the v-neck makes her shoulders particularly broad and her shoulders are also very prominent. Some netizens also took screenshots of the original photo, which was not processed in any way. In the photo, Liu Yifei was wearing a tight evening dress, with a strap tied around her arm, and the excess fat on it was cut off. Liu Yifei has been questioned for her body shape, and this time is no exception. Many people accused her of being too big. Zhang Ziaofei, who was also born after 1985, is also in a pretty good situation now. She wore a black shirt with missing underwear, exposing a pair of thin and straight thighs, which made Tong Dui feel a huge pressure. However, netizens still expressed strong dissatisfaction with Zhang Ziaofei's styling. People on the internet think that the makeup artist was not careful, and the makeup on Zhang Ziaofei was yukiri, and the makeup on her face was dirty, and the foundation on her face was so pale. Some people also proposed to fire the makeup artist. But on second thought, Tang Yan and Liu Yifei are two roles, and Zhang Ziaofei is not originally in the same circle, so it makes sense. The theme of this red carpet is about Wan Jin's status. Before walking on the red carpet, she revealed her style of walking on the red carpet. Wang Xi has long hair and dyed the ends of her hair green. Some people speculate that this is because her husband is unfaithful. Wang Xi appeared on the red carpet in a black leather dress with her collar slightly open. Compared with the previous red carpet, she looked a little more noble and energetic. Compared with Liu Yifri, her charm is not inferior to Liu Yifri. And Wang Xi was smiling all the time, with elegant temperament and full of energy, and was not hurt by her husband's cheating incident at all. Some people think this is a new kind of beauty. In addition, many female stars also participated in gorgeous dresses. Compared with Tang Yan, Jo Soon is more reserved. She didn't even borrow any skirt. She just walked on the stage in a sexy little suit. It was also because of her very eye-catching black silk that people could find her among a crowd at a glance. The four nominated actresses Yan Ni, Zhang Yan, Ni Huangji, and Song Jia all wore relatively simple clothes on the red carpet. Yan Ni and Tang Yang compete for the best actress, Zhang Yan, Ni Huangji, and Song Jia are all likely to be nominated for the best supporting actress. Zhen wore a medium-colored tulle dress and light makeup, but her good figure can still be seen. Wang Huo relied on the collision style of bright red, but her state seemed to have not fully recovered. She was wearing heavy makeup on her face, which looked a bit stiff. Lin Yun's appearance is delicate and charming, 
and her bones are well proportioned, which complements the clothes she wears, showing the beauty of the jewelry to the fullest. When some actresses' appearance wins praise and others are ridiculed, we have to point out that the actresses who walk the red carpet this time have their own jobs. After all, their biggest reliance is their own products, and walking the red carpet is just an embellishment. At the star-studded Magnolia Awards ceremony, the image and image of the major actresses attracted much attention and attracted countless heated discussions. But the more important thing is the hard work and sweat they put in during the performance. I hope they can dedicate more to everyone. Thank you for watching the video, please leave your opinion in the comments section. Don't forget to press the channel subscription button. If this is the first time you watch a video on the channel,